One of the reasons we, we started Cha Cha was to create a stage for people. There were lots of people who were toying with this sort of um, dressing up and doing drag and uh, kind of being club kiddy, but there weren't any formal spaces where they could they could take that energy and try and do something productive with it. I, I do go, well, what, what's, what's the point here? Yes, things can be beautiful. Yes, things can be fabulous. Yes, things can be extreme. But I think you have to have those spaces where you're not only able to be whoever you think you are, but you're able to put that person into action. Um, and I like to think that that's what Cha Cha does in a little way and, and has done in the city for the last few years. country move forward when the new Minister for Equality is against gays adopting and transsexuals changing their gender. What made you change your view, if you have, on gay couples adopting, teaching homosexuality in schools, um, transsexuals being allowed legally to change their gender? What Have you changed your minds on, on, on all those things? I, I tell you that I've changed... I, I'll give you an example of why I've changed my mind. <laughs> There are certain things in our in our society which are considered to be innate and essential um, by people, and one of those things is the idea of how it is to be a man and how it is to be a woman, and I think that can be an incredibly threatening thing when you present yourself, especially for, because drag is one of those, unless you're very, very kind of feminine and kind of passing, which not a lot of drag queens are, um, or, you know, the, the other way, unless you're very, very passing as a, a man, as a drag king, um, and you are conforming to how, how they're seeing that gender, it confuses people and it unsettles something that they consider to, that, that they have assumed is natural and is the same for everyone. So in, in a way you do, um, and I think people can have that same emotional reaction to transgender people as well, because it upsets that idea of what they thought and what they may have based their identity on, of the way that they thought the world was. Um, and that can be very, very troubling for people. And, and in many ways, it's what you, as a drag queen, it's one of the things you do is to trouble that and is to make hyper real and pronounce over the top kind of forms of gender and other kinds of transformation that is going to um, shake a foundation a little bit.